Aquarius and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of November 21st and I do want to say um, happy Thanksgiving to all of you that's coming up uh, next week I am thankful for all of you here I love doing these coffee cup readings for you all and do check out Astro Jar, Middle Ponds Astro Jar when you get a chance and my other two channels Spiritual Owl and Spiritual Gems and now let's get on with your reading all right you know what's coming in focus here is um one well, uh, the cup is pretty yellow so we're looking at frustrating energy um struggles with you know there's some struggles with either issues or people around you um struggles with authority that's what's showing up so let's look over here. Love is in focus. Um, life in general, um, lifestyle, how you are living. There is some frustration over some things. There is some reality checks coming in. So let me, I'm working on my phone because my camera is, the audio is bad. I have to buy a new camera. Okay. So, when I'm looking at the personal side here, what I am really seeing is um, there are some things that are up in the air. Um, for for others, you know, you're some are really you'd be finding some temporary kind of fulfillment. Um, so there's highs and lows, you know, but then reality like kind of um, comes smacking back. There's like um, frustration of um, issues or things that have been done. For some, there could have been some mistakes, um, you know, that you made or some regrets and remorse. That's what's showing up here. Um, you know, when I'm looking over here to your outer um, surface, there is some negative energy, um, negativity. Um, for some of you at work, or with groups of people, you know, depends, you know, some of you don't have a job or just groups of people or whatever you do, mostly during your day, you're out of sphere here. Um, you know, it, do watch your temper. It does show up here. Um, some of you may want to quit your job. That's, you know, there's some frustration over work or a group of people, whatever there is. Um, some others will just suddenly go on a trip or just to get away. Um, I just see some kind of impulsive move going here. Now, that impulsivity is okay if you do that, but also kind of watch your temper because there's some challenges with some people or, you know, people close to you, work or friends or whatever you want to say. Um, and, you know, I just do see frustration or anger. Now, okay. When I'm looking here in the matters of the heart and that, there is showing disagreements, um, arguments. There's possible even violence. So really, you know, watch your temper or watch out for other hotheads because there's a sense of violence here. And I, you know, I don't like it too much. Um, some of you are still looking for answers. Um, some of you may have been questioned by some other people close to you or I don't know if it's a partner, friend or children, um, you know, um, others question you, your recent activities or your recent decisions. They may feel that you have um, done them wrong or you've made wrong moves. I mean, that's what's just showing up here. For some, you know, there are some regrets here. Or also there's simply a um, dissatisfaction. For some, there is some depression. Yeah. Some are really like, you know, picking up the pieces or whatever it is and you're moving away from it and you're letting it go. Um, so some of you are really like, it's like there's a sense of here, if there is some um, other people questioning you, um, it's like own your own stuff too, you know, um, 
we all have our own stuff, you know, we're not, none of us are roses. So own your own stuff. If there is someone, you know, coming or accusing you, there's some sense of accusations or just being questions about your recent motives, moves, they may be hurt by you, whatever it is, own your own stuff or your own part in it. That's one thing that's showing up too. And then let go of things, you know, we, we make mistakes, we make wrong moves, we do, you know, we, we all go through that in life. So just let it go and try to stay out of a depressive state because I'm seeing some depression here for some of you, not for all of you. For some of you, this, these events and that have really made you put fire underneath your butt and you're really trying to change. Again, what is um coming in here is uh, friends, um, well, frenemies. I see some frenemies here. Things that will make you actually reevaluate your, your state, you know. Focus is heavy on making some lifestyle changes um, for the better, for health, um, you know, your habits, eating habits, um, things that you, it's saying you've got to put a focus on changing some of that stuff in your life. Um, how you manage your time. Also, reevaluating some situations because it seems like there's been some struggles or some hurt feelings with other people. But you got to look at um, have have you given too much to others? Did they did you receive from them? You know, or vice versa. So you got to really own your part there. Have you been too generous with your time, and um, you know you're not receiving anything from other people, um, or have um, they have been very generous with you with their time, their um, you know, whatever resources and that, and what have you given back? So that, you know, it, there's a, the energies goes back and forth there. So there's a sense of, um, reevaluating then and maybe being questioned by others. So that's what's showing up here. And there is just, you know, there are some changes coming in. I see some of you will be really like, um, assessing some stuff and just, um, weighing some changes. Um, so the focus is really is to make some changes here and to try to get out of a depressive state. Um, on your plate here, which is really interesting, is it is showing that um, you may be challenged by some situation or a person uh, may come in and um, just ask you some questions. There is that um, sense here. Also, again, it's so showing some depression here. Um it's showing, you know, um, depression, um, dissatisfaction. Um, it's a back and forth here or some issues, you know, they just keep coming back and forth, back and forth. You haven't dealt with them or they're just repeating issues or things like that is showing up here. So there is showing some kind of depression here. A um, little bit of solitude, isolation within yourself. Dissatisfaction is what I'm seeing um, for some of you. It really came up prominently in this reading, you know. If this doesn't resonate, try your moon or your rising sign. But I just, you know, when I'm looking for general, I look at what is really coming through that's important to say to some out there. So there is some, you know, back and forth kind of energy, things coming in. Um, there are some people going to like maybe confront you or situations are going to arise that you're going to be confronted, some demons within you, self, yourself, or what is it that you need to change? Or what is it you need to change about people that hurt you? I'm not saying it's always just you. I'm saying, you know, there could be your lifestyle needs to change or the friends you keep or um, situations. There's just some dissatisfaction about it. So that's what's coming through. Yeah, someone really is going to be coming in and kind of juggling that, um, shaking that up. That's what's showing for some of you. Anyway, um, Aquarius, that was your reading for the week ahead of um, uh, November 21st. And like I said, um, enjoy your Thanksgiving. I'm very thankful for all of you and have a fabulous weekend and catch you back next time next week for your next coffee cup reading. Until then, bye guys.